obviously 80 wins is not where you want to be. You want to be better than that. Um, but what do you have to do with this current roster to, to get to where you guys want to be? I think, you know, one of the one of the good things about what happened in 2017, we got to see some young, young players take some steps forward. And we also feel for the first time in a little while, we now have, you look at that club that won the, the AAA National Championship, and we've got some pieces on that club that we feel could step up and be core players for us uh, in the years to come. So. You know, you look at the potential for some of these young guys, and you know, Eric mentioned uh, a lot of those teams that that we see playing deep into October. They all seem to have these these core groups, um, and a lot of times they're young groups. And we feel we have the chance to have that. It's on us to figure out how to augment that as best as possible, how to make the right free agent decisions, the right trade decisions to augment that uh, as best as we can. Is there a couple of areas, whether it be first base or in the outfield or in the bullpen, that you guys feel like you need to address at the winter meetings? Well, you know, just given uh, you know some of the departures that we had via free agency, um, I think that there's some natural openings that come from that. Uh, the good thing about a lot of these conversations is that sometimes, you know, those things those things can move around depending on moves that we make. I think what we do like about this group, uh, and knowing we did have some departures, and obviously the bullpen that was so good down the stretch, in particular a lot of those guys, a lot of the experience in that group has left for free agency. The nice thing is around the diamond, we do have a good bit of depth when you look at uh, some of the options we have uh, on the club and then some of the guys coming uh, through the upper levels of the system. We think we have uh, you know, some good depth and some pieces that can move around and, uh, and form a good club. Now that you've been able to start putting your own mark on the roster. What kind of philosophy are you going with when you're putting that roster together? There's been a lot of continuity with our group as a whole, you know, from back when Andrew was here to, to, to Matt, um, you know, in his previous position to the, the two of us now. Um, I think our philosophies by and large, you know, the underpinnings of that are very similar <laughs> to, to where they've been. And I think our past behavior is a pretty good indication, generally speaking, of how I think we're gonna operate moving forward. But but with that, um, you know, we believe in learning, <laughs> we believe in growing. And uh, to the extent that our philosophies evolve and change as we move forward, I think it's more about learning from past decisions and, and approaches and trying to build upon that as we go forward. How do you balance the cutting of payroll while also trying to add key pieces to this roster that could contribute? It's incredibly challenging. Uh, you know, like I, I mentioned earlier, and you know, it's it's about young talent. <laughs> it's about the guys we have coming through our system. We're very proud of that, and all the people that have been involved to, to get us to that point there. Uh, it's it's timing, you know, and when you are a smaller market team, it's, it's not something where I think every year you can go in and, you know, you, 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 you got to be very precise with your steps. You got to hit it right. You can't you can't go in every year with the goals to compete and just to spend your way out of it. So uh, it takes some good fortune. It takes a lot of preparation. Uh, it takes a lot of dedicated players that um, you know to pan out and you know our prospects to step forward and uh, and to put us in a position to continue to win games at this level. So um, it's a, a long-winded way of saying it's it's very difficult and a lot goes into it, but it is something we believe we can do.